Yeah, it's pretty cool. I mean, even though he's the head coach now, that he's still that same guy every day. He's been since day one um, when he took this you know, defensive coordinator job here. So to be able to interact with, with him like that, um, it's really cool. And, you know, for us, we know we go to him many times. Just you know, know, to know that he's staying how he is today, it's, you know, it's really special. But yeah, just seeing that, I'm like, yeah, like this guy, like he has that factor in like seeing how well like the offense, defense, everyone, you know, responded to him. That's what we kind of knew, like, hey, like this is the right guy for this program. Yeah, I mean, we fully support Kyron and Kyle. I mean, we wouldn't be in this position today without them. We wouldn't have 11 wins, and we're going to support them and love them. But, you know, obviously our philosophy is always next man in. You know, Logan, um, Audrey, Sebo, Chris, all those guys have to step up for us. And I'm excited to see them. I mean, we've seen, you know, flashes of all, all four of those guys this season. And, you know, we have a great room. We have a great running back coach. Coach Taylor's do a phenomenal job with those guys. So we're going to be in good shape. Yeah, I haven't watched a ton, just watched the Baylor game, but I know statistically speaking, they're I think they're top 10 in every category, lead the country in sacks. Um, and really the what I took away from watching Baylor is they have a ton of looks. And we're going to be prepared to face all these different looks, especially in the bowl game. I mean, last game of the season, they have nothing left to lose. And it's going to be a great test for us. You know, we've only trended up the past six weeks. and. For us, it's be kind of like our, our final test of the season. I'm excited, you know, to see these guys get out there and you know, get after it.